Earlier, I outlined the reason why I believe Garmin Basecamp is so difficult for beginners to use. Now let's look at nine reasons why I believe Basecamp is a good program and worth the effort to learn how to use it. Several viewers have commented that Basecamp is the worst program ever written. Does it have an unusual design? Yes. Does it have a steep learning curve? Yes. Does it require users to put in some effort to get to know it and like it? Yes, quite a bit of effort. Are new users easily frustrated? Yes. But is it the worst program ever written? Of course not. Let's look at nine reasons why Basecamp is a useful, good program. Reason number nine. It's free. You can download, install, and use the program for free. If you have a Garmin GPS, the program and the maps for your Garmin device are free. You don't have to pay for the program and there is no monthly service charge to use it. If you don't have a Garmin device or Garmin maps, keep watching because there is a feature that may interest you. Reason number eight. Basecamp has interesting, obscure features. You might not know these features are available, but once you do, you may find a use for them. You can import geotagged photos. A geotagged photo is one that has geographical coordinates of the location where the picture was taken. Most smartphones have the ability to geotag the photos taken with the phone. Most cameras don't have the ability to geotag the photos taken on them because they don't have a built-in GPS. If you're running your GPS while you are taking pictures with your camera, and if the time of day of both devices match, you can use Basecamp to geotag the photos you took with the camera. If you're into geocaching, you can import geocache locations as waypoints. Reason number seven, Basecamp has an open architecture. You can add additional maps and points of interest. You can import maps and overlay them on the main routing map. Here's an example. This is a route through Acadia National Park. I've imported a topographical map of the park. When I overlay the map, I can see the terrain along the route. Also, you can install free open source maps and use them for routing instead of the Garmin maps. This is the city navigator map, and this is an open source map for the Southeast United States. With the open source map selected, I can select two waypoints and create a route that same as if I was using the Garmin map. Installing open source maps is an advanced topic and not for computer novices, but it is a way to use Basecamp without buying a Garmin device or a subscription to Garmin maps. Garmin map files include points of interest that you can search and add to routes. You can import additional points of interest and use them in your routes. In this folder, I've imported all the rest areas of the United States. Reason number six. In Basecamp, you can organize your data in folders and lists. This is probably the most powerful feature. It allows you to store all your data, but separate it into meaningful subsets. Sometimes I create alternate routes to a destination. I store them in separate lists under one folder. I can display both alternatives or display each of them separately. And here's a bonus. You aren't limited to one database of folders and lists. You can create multiple databases for different purposes. I keep my personal data in one database and the data for those, these YouTube videos in another database. 
and super bonus in my video about databases I explained how you can use the same database on your desktop computer or your laptop. Reason number five, Basecamp can display multiple routes and waypoints on the map simultaneously. I've worked with other programs that allow you to open several routes at a time, but I couldn't see all the routes at one time. This Basecamp feature is most helpful when you are planning long trips and creating one route for each day. Reason number four, you can use Basecamp for different types of routing or tracking. You can use it for driving, motorcycling, hiking, or any of the other pre-programmed activities. Each of the activities can be configured with the settings you want, and if the pre-programmed activities don't suit you, you can create additional activities. Reason number three, Basecamp is not limited to working with Garmin devices. You can export GPX files that you can use with any standalone GPS or vehicle GPS units that allow you to import a GPX file, such as Harley, Honda, and Indian motorcycles. Reason number two, Basecamp integrates with Garmin devices, making it easy to transfer data and to and from the device. Reason number one, Basecamp does not require an internet connection to use it after the maps have been installed. All the maps and points of interest are stored on your computer. Now I have a few questions for you. Please leave a comment with your answers. Question number one, do you know of another routing program that has all the maps and POIs stored on your computer and doesn't require an internet connection to use it? I have Sigic on my phone which has all the maps, but they don't have a version for the PC or Mac. Question number two, are there other advantages of Basecamp that I haven't mentioned? Question number three, what is your favorite feature of Basecamp? I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, give it a thumbs up and leave a comment. If you want to support the channel, you can buy me a cup of coffee at buymeacoffee.com or go to the Amazon pages on my website where I have affiliate links to products I use. Links are in the description. In any case, I appreciate your support and all the positive comments. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.